Hello Divine Masculine and welcome to your power message for Sunday, Super Sunday. My name's Liz and this is Guided by Angels. And the energy around you feels so much better today than it did yesterday. It feels like you're sobering up and obviously I know that many of you haven't been drinking but it feels like you're coming out of this energy where you've been tired, you've been drained, it's like you've been waking up and you feel revitalized today. So I feel a lot of energy within you, a lot of motivation, a lot of clarity. So you're feeling much better today. You're feeling lighter, brighter and ready for the next step. So I want to bring in the charming Oracle secret love messages today to see what you may still be going through, working through. And I'm going to use the Archangel Oracle cards to bring some guidance in around this. So Thank you, angels. Wow. So what are you going through? So jumping straight out the deck, quite a few cards. And then we're going to shuffle the Archangel Oracle to see what you can do to help any of this. So this will kind of resonate with, you know, the messages and help you to work through any fears. So the energy today is, you do not know this, but even after all this time, I still care so deeply for you. I wish I could just tell you this. So... You're saying to your feminine, I love you. I care so deeply about you. After all this time, you may not know this. So you're wondering if your feminine even realizes how much you care. And you're saying, I wish I could just tell you this. I wish I could. But you're saying as well, it's just too complicated for us to be together right now. So what you're saying to your feminine is, I'm waiting to free myself up and release myself from my karmic binds so I can be with you properly and not only tell you how I feel about you but show you how I feel about you and be with you properly in a very powerful way. So you're saying, I want to get rid of the complications so we can be together. I don't want to drag you into my drama or my toxicity or anything I'm dealing with. I want to sort it out first. It's too complicated for us to be together right now. And the message coming through from heaven is uncomplicated that. When we see complications, usually we're in fear. We can't see a way out. We're struggling. And there's a lot of clarity coming into your life today. So you can see a way out. You know there is one, but you're really saying it's a bit complicated right now. Let me deal with my complications and then I'm going to tell you how much I care about you. I know that you miss me and you want to talk to me, but I just can't seem to find the right words to say to you right now. I'm sorry. So you're apologizing to your feminine for being quiet or for being silent or distant because you're saying to your feminine, I know you miss me. I know you want to talk to me. I know you're waiting for me to contact you. I just can't quite find the words because it's all a bit complicated right now. And I know that we have a deep soul connection. The love I feel for you has always been there. So the masculine saying it's always been there. The love has always been there. I know we have a deep connection. So masculine's what you're realizing is that connection is not going away. It's not going away. And you realize, look at this, nothing you do can stop you from being with your family. Because you're saying, I can't stop being with you. I want to move on and let you go, but I can't. So what you're saying is, you know, it would be so much easier for you to move on and let me go. But I can't let you go because something keeps pulling me back to you. And I feel that we have unfinished business to handle first. So what I'm actually feeling with this is, you're saying, I want to move on. I want to move on and leave the past behind so that we can start again. You're saying that here. I want to leave the past behind us and start over with you. So you're saying, I want to be with you, Divine Feminine. I want to be able to move on. And I want to be able to let go of the pain and the past and all the things that stop me from being with you. But I just can't. Something keeps pulling me back, not only to you, but to my situation because I've got unfinished business. So when I'm connecting with this, I'm not feeling this as you're saying, I want to move on from the divine feminine or I want to let the divine feminine go. You're saying, I want to move on and be free. But right now, something keeps pulling me back because I've got unfinished business. And that's because life is quite complicated for you. You know, you're saying it's a bit too complicated for us to be together right now. And they give me a little bit of fear. 
And you're saying, I'm really afraid that you don't love me the way I love you. So really what this is, you know, there's so much of you that wants to be with your twin right now and wants to express the way you feel and wants to make it all happen because the love's always been there, but you're also dealing with your karmic binds. And that's, you're struggling with that because something also keeps pulling you back to that so that you can deal with it and heal it. So I feel that as well, this is for anyone who's watching who's masculine, maybe back and forth in a karmic connection. And maybe you're thinking, why? You're masculine and saying, I've just got unfinished business to take care of. It's a bit complicated right now. I need to heal this. And the angels are saying, what you have to do is set crystal clear intentions and that will bring in peace. So peace comes from rem remembering that only love is real. Right now you're in the ego, you're dealing with things. Love is what's real. The love is what you have for your divine feminine. You know, you're very clear about that. The love I feel for you has always been there. And I know that we have a very deep soul connection. And the crystal clear intention is be clear about what you desire and focus upon it with unwavering faith. And when you do that, you'll find peace. So you're not in peace energy right now because there's complications. You're feeling a lot better about things today. You're a lot clearer about things today. And some of you are so clear that you want to leave the past behind and start over. But those of you who've got complicated karmic situations that keep dragging you back in, you've got to sort out that unfinished business first. You've got things to handle first. And you know that your feminine is kind of waiting for you to apologize and move forward. You know, you know you need to do that, but you want to deal with what you're dealing with first. You're saying, I know that I still care about you. I know that I still love you and I want to tell you this, but I'm a little bit afraid that you don't love me the way I love you. And that's fear-based. Of course, your feminine loves you the way that you love them. Feminines, you may be watching this thinking, well, I'm afraid that they don't love me the way I love them. Let go of fear. What's true is, is love. What's real is love. Peace comes from remembering that only love is real. And that's the truth. Crystal clear intentions. Masculines, I feel you are struggling because you know you need to let go of the past and you're saying I will come back to you one day and I'll fight for this love these cards are moving on top of the deck and I'm feeling so sad and down without you in my life you really were my sunshine and always made me smile I really miss what we had so you're reminiscing about the past you're going over it in your mind and it's causing pain and nostalgia and you're saying, I want to be with you, but I just can't leave this karmic situation yet. So, and this card's moving too. So there really is this energy around dealing with the karmic situation. And that can be complicated. You want to be with your feminine, but you also know you've got to handle what's going on. And you're saying, I see you and everyone I meet, you're constantly running through my mind and heart. So... You're seeing them everywhere. Masculines, you're reminded of your feminine everywhere you go. And that's showing you that you have a deep soul connection. Okay? You have all these feelings. You know you're going to come back and fight for this love. And that's what Archangel Michael is saying. Set those crystal clear intentions. Be very clear about what you desire. And focus upon it with unwavering faith. And that will help you to find peace. Because, of course, they love you the way that you love them. And this is really about you struggling with the karmic situation. And you're afraid that because of the karmic situation, you've tarnished the love or tainted the love in some way. Because you're being honest and saying, it's a bit too complicated for us to be together right now. I want to be with you, but I can't leave the karmic situation behind just yet because I need to sort it out. Okay, I want to move on from that. And I want to let you go, but I can't. So what this is as well is, it's like the masculine is saying, and I'm addressing both twins, because even though this is a masculine reading, I know so many families are cross-watching. And masculines, what you're really saying is, I can't leave this karmic situation just yet because I've got to finish it. I've unfinished business. And I want to let you go your own way so I can handle this. But I can't let you go. So masculines, it's like you're saying to your feminine, it will be so much easier if you just moved on because you deserve someone so much better than me. 
But you, you know that in your soul you can't because you belong to each other. So you're also releasing that doubt. So when I'm connecting with the energy today, there's a lot of clarity there about you know what you want. But there's also this push-pull energy because you want to do what's right. And you know you want to do what's right for yourself, which means leaving behind the karmic situation. But you also know you need to do it at the right time. And that may be very triggering for your feminine because your feminine wants you now. So you're saying... I'll let you go so you can try and be with someone else and move on. Even though it's not what I want, I want you to be happy. Yet that's the worst thing you can do because that will just make you even more sad. And you feel sad and down without your feminine in your life. They the sunshine and makes you smile and lights you up. And of course you miss what you had, but you can have it again in a much better, brighter way. So move on from the pain. So when you're saying to your feminine... Okay, I, I want you to know that I've tried to move on and let you go, but I can't. Something keeps pulling me back to, to you. You know, and we have unfinished business. But also this is about clearing up the karmic situations first so you can be together. So don't get triggered or get confused by this card. The masculine is really going through pain because the masculine wants you, Divine Feminine, to be happy. And part of them knows that you can't be happy together while they are still with someone else. So they are kind of saying to you, I'll let you go. Even though that's the worst thing they can do for them because they don't want to let you go. They want to be with you. It makes them miserable to be without you. But your masculine is saying to you, if it makes you happy to be with someone else, then I'll have to suck it up and take it. And they're giving me fear. A lot of fear around that, thinking, contemplating. So masculines, you know what you need to do. I said that to you yesterday in your reading. You know what you need to do. You know what you have to sort out. And there's fear, you know, fear of your family moving on. Fear around this love. A lot of fear being released as I'm connecting with this reading. And the angel's saying focus on peace. Love is what's real. Be clear with heaven about what you want. Be clear with your feminine about what you want. Be clear with your karmic partner. Speak your truth. Don't be afraid. And when you do that, all this worry about your feminine not loving you or them wanting to be with someone else or moving on or you thinking that's the right thing for them to do, it will all go away because you belong to each other and you were meant to be. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.